where the leader of the controversial Operation Dudula is spending the weekend behind bars. Ntlanta Lakslamini is expected, was expected rather, to appear in court after he was arrested on a Thursday. Now he's been at the forefront of protests against undocumented foreign nationals. Let's head back to the Johannesburg Central Police Station now where we've got our reporter Lino Gulekulu um, engaging those supporters who have gathered outside the police station. Uh, Lino Gulekulu, many of them saying that they're not going to leave until Atlanta Lux is released. No doubt that this is probably not going to be happening. Robio, I do have to apologize to you if I am cutting you at this stage, but I can barely hear you in terms of what you are trying to ask us, but we can confirm we are just outside uh, the police station, central Johannesburg police, police station. This is where Tankalax is detained. We saw those visuals yesterday when he was, in fact, walking inside here. But this story kept on developing. Just to bring you up to speed, this particular morning we were expecting that he would be taken uh, to Rodiport Magistrate Court. This was information we were getting last night. Unfortunately, that did not happen. What we do understand is that police are exercising their right to, in fact, detain him and question him for about 24 to 48 hours in terms of keeping him here. But what we've learned around noon was that he was not yet charged and that the investigating officer in fact just arrived about an hour or so ago so we just want to get an update in terms of uh, what is actually happening with some of those that were inside negotiating with the station commander and speaking to police thank you so much to both of you for joining us one from Tutula, one from alexandra parliament who's also here to support Nkantalax. Mkulu, you'll just introduce yourself and tell us uh, in terms of your position but explain to us what is happening what is the delay uh, that uh, so and are not going to court and ultimately it's uh, being here and right now uh, demonstrating. Thank you so much for the opportunity. Uh, it is Nango Enoch, uh, the executive member of Operation Tutula nationally. Uh, we are very much disappointed. We are so disappointed with the, with the abrogation of the law. Uh, the injustices that have been happening here, uh, we've been here since yesterday. Uh, the day on which uh, Tatalax was arrested. Uh, we came here to understand and find out what are the charges that have been um, uh, trumped. We know the charges have been trumped. Uh, it's a make-up, it's a makeshift charge sheet. Uh, we were told that Ntanta was going to appear in court tomorrow. He was going to be charged yesterday, last night, uh, of which that didn't happen. We found ourselves with the masses here with all the support from all the alliances that we have, uh, the Patriotic Alliance, the Action SA, uh, Alexander Parliament, Soweto Parliament, uh, Alexander Movement, we've been there, all of us, and other political parties, and concerned South African citizens. Unfortunately, Ntanta never appeared in court, of which we were told that he was going to appear today. But from the, from the look of things, he hasn't been charged yet which simply means that there's a political message that has not been sent yet. Because this is a political case, it's not a criminal case. It is a case that has been orchestrated right inside parliament to ensure that they silence the, the voice of the masses against uh, the revolution that is imminent, to ensure that our people regain their confidence, they regain their status as the citizens of this country. All right, let me just bring in uh, Alexandra Parliament that are also here to support them. Mkul, now you'll introduce yourself from Alexandra Parliament, but we heard that you are also speaking to the station commander, continuing to engage them, and you said that one of the things you'd like to see manifest is in fact Ntantalax coming out today if the schedule permits. Just talk to us about those negotiations. Uh, the negotiations are ongoing. It's some, oh, by the way, sorry man, the name is Vincent Dima, chairperson of Alexander Parliament. We've been uh, up there with uh, uh, Alex, uh, Alex Movement and Operation Tutula and all other structures trying to negotiate the release of Ntantalax. One, Ntantalax was fetched by Itas Team SAPS. Itas Team deals with people that... Uh, so I'm failing to understand with the same task team that is supposed to uh, utter and grab 
criminals, hardcore criminals, are the ones that fetched Untan. I mean, if we had just called Untan and said, Untan, come to the police station, this is what is going on. Untan was going to bring himself. I like being taken like a criminal the way that it happened yesterday. But anyways, uh, let's 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 go past that. Hopefully, through the negotiations that we have, we'll schedule one school zone. Ntandalax will get a police station bail today. Uh, but initially, what we were told by one of the captains that was there who was trying to profile was that Ntanda was arrested in Dobsonville, of which Ntanda, that is not true. Ntanda was arrested around. So Ntanda is here, he's not been charged, no one is attending to his case. So we like to emphasize Uti, whoever that is pushing this, besides Julius, we know what it is not only him that is pushing all this thing. This is the leader that must go back to the people. These people are not going to live here. So online just so clear Uti. We say PS Stellanens um seven so right, then into right, civil rights. So all right, in the interest of time, we will leave it there for now. But it's not for the lack of the leadership here. The Tutula movement from Alexandra is also here. Patriotic uh, uh, Alliance that is led by, in fact, Baba Uke Nugunen is also here. Uh, so there are many organizations that are here. But in the interest of time, we'll have to leave it there for now. But there are still hopes that Tantalax will walk out of this particular uh, police station today. They are saying that if the church will allow, they'll continue to negotiate for him. But but on the other hand, there are all of these masses, these people that are here saying that they are not going anywhere until they get a clear understanding of what will happen with Kantalak. So many of these people are saying they'll remain here. But more than anything, leadership of these different organizations is inside. They are negotiating to see if they can bring out Kantalak today. Lindo Gushetulu out in Johannesburg following that story around Ntlantla Lux Lamini, who has been arrested um, and is set to spend the weekend in jail. But the supporters are hopeful that something will come out of those negotiations and he might be released this evening.